Ole. <laughs> Breakfast. Something I would never do in the past, but I love doing now. Bread. Into coffee. Dip, dip, put more. I mean, it's sour, sour, no, dip. It's actually quite good just dipping bread into coffee. Mm. Bangles. Hey, some sort of delicious fish. Okay, my Buntag. It's about 9 a.m. now. In case you're wondering, I spent 1,888 pesos, stayed in a nice room here at this place called Vine in Malave. They give you free breakfast and it's actually really good. So uh, I, I am leaving late because I ended up spending about an hour and a half talking to this really cool couple uh, in the restaurant. You wouldn't have seen it on video, but uh, I might see them later today. Hope I do. I'm gonna head down there towards the Polog and uh, at least I think down there. And yeah, let's go on the road and uh, start the day strong. It's really my in it though. Oh. Two cold springs, 1.5 kilometers to go. Yes, this is gonna be a refreshing morning. One in, Bintag. Big tower, big tower. Oh, thank you. Hey, there we are again. Everybody goes swimming. So uh, my friend earlier from breakfast. <laughs> oh, this is your family. It's funny. Hello again. Now, now I'm vlogging. Now you can see yourselves in camera. Uh, what you wouldn't have seen is earlier this morning. I had uh, a chica chica with uh, oh, it's Chris, right? Chris and Marissa, and, <laughs> and now their whole family is coming to the spring. Hello, hello, sister. <laughs> Cool. Rock on. Oh, you want to do it down there? Down there? Oh, down there. Wait, let's, let's chat on picture about the screen. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Chat on the top one. Oh, I'm just swimming. Nice to see you guys, man. This is Chris. He's from Guernsey. Oh, Guernsey. Guernsey. Uh, I'll chat to him later. I'm going to go swimming. Hello, sir. Good morning. Feeling it? 35 now? Feeling it? Feeling it? Yes. Oh, solo. I'll see you down there, bro. 50 pesos, here we go. Lather? Oh, sure. what's up, I? Yes? Wow, this is cool. Ah, it's like a magic spring resort. Uh, cool, I'm excited for this. This would be rad.
Okay, so this is Chris. Hey. This is Marissa. Hello. Uh, they have been married for 15 years. 15 years. Uh, Marissa is originally from Bonifacio. Uh, Chris is originally from Guernsey, but they met in Osamis in 2000. One. 2001. Chris came here in 2001. And believe it or not, they got married when you were... What, 20? 20? 19. 19. But they've been married for 15 years. They live overseas, but they come back almost every year now. Except recently because they have kids, two boys, so it's a bit more expensive taking flights. Yeah. But uh, what are you guys doing? Just hanging out today? Or? Uh, with the family. Uh, so the family you're seeing out there singing, who I'm going to go sing for later. Oh, yeah. is, uh, <laughs> Uh, this is their family, and this is their last day here, actually. They're heading back to Guernsey, though. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, I just wanted to show you guys them, because uh, I actually thought it was really cool, their love story. Chris, uh, when he got married here in the Philippines, none of his family were here, because his father couldn't travel, and then his mom didn't want to travel because he wasn't going. So he actually walked down the aisle in Osamis with Marissa, and who was holding your arm? Who was, uh, I had a adopted mother and father. Adopted mother and father. <laughs> and then Marissa here, uh, you said your family at first was a bit nervous about getting married so young. Yes, I was very young. But uh, in the end, all was good, and they had a wedding here, a wedding overseas, and others having a good day 15 days later in uh, Mahayag. So. And two children's now. Two children. And they're really cool, and I'll write about them on Facebook, and that's about it. I don't want to ruin the day by filming them all the time. So. <laughs> Time to get changed. Just in case you're wondering, there's a lot of water here because there's no tap, it's just free flow. Woo! Let's get changed. cool about this place is you got these awesome swimming pools and they're all different um, behind me magic slide clean pool and now in front of me super waterfall fountain pool I'm going into the waterfall Oh my god! He goes and goes and goes! Oh 
Paco? Paco? Where where'd you buy the market? I buy the market. Paco. Wow, we're gonna Pagadian. You came from Pagadian. Ah. These guys came from Pagadian. They bought a Paco. I've just never seen a fish like that. It's so unique. Freddy, can you pick it up? Can I see? Wow. Okay, that was incredible. Uh, Chris and Marissa are so friendly. Their family there, super nice, super fun, just jamming. That's a very typical Filipino family hangout. Swimming, food, singing, good vibes. Uh, I'm gonna carry on now back to the road and start heading towards the Polog up and over a little mini mountain range, I think, or Bukit area. They have a cool love story. I'm gonna write about them on Facebook. Go and read it if you want. They have a really cool love story. And I love adventuring in this country and just meeting people. That was super cool. Hello. <laughs> people are looking at me. Power on. I feel so refreshed. I found out that water is 99.8% potable, comes straight out from the ground, the rocks there. It's checked every month for quality. You could drink it. You could drink those swimming pools. Awesome. So I was thinking about stopping here for a snack or, uh, I don't know, coffee, but it's literally like two or three little streets is a very small local town, Josefina. And uh, I see rain brewing too. I'm just gonna try and power on a bit into the mountains. It's cricket interesting. But you just gotta believe. Let's go. I remember this bridge. Just crossed over from Zamboanga del Sur to Zamboanga del Norte. 